Hello, my name is Dr. Tina Wong and I am a board certified pediatrician practicing in the Los Angeles area. I'm also a homeschooling mom of seven and today I would like to talk to you about informed self-care. What is informed self-care? It is being educated and informed enough to know how to take care of yourself and your loved ones. So we are at a very interesting time. I myself am in the home protecting our wellness as a family and protecting the wellness of my community by staying indoors. Some of you may be on the front lines serving in hospitals, in clinics, um, serving as a firefighter, police officer. Some of you may be even quarantined in your own home from your family members because of symptoms. So my prayers, my heart goes out to you. I hope that what I teach you today can be used to bring you hope and to help boost your immunity and to help your emotional state. So I wanna talk about some essential oils that you may have in your home and I'm gonna tell you what they are and give you a chance to go ahead and collect them so that together we can experience them as we learn about them. The first oil is a Melissa essential oil. Then any citrus oil will do. Lemon is one of my favorites and so is green mandarin. So grab one of your citrus essential oils. Um, Copaiba essential oil. Breathe essential oil. Stronger Kids Blend essential oil and Calmer essential oil. And you don't have to have all of these, but if you have some of them, gather them. Also gather a pen and some paper and a full glass of water in either glass or porcelain or metal, okay? So you can pause the video to do that. All right, now that we're ready, go ahead and get your Melissa oil out. It's a small five ml bottle. It takes 60 to 70 pounds of Melissa plant in order to make this small bottle. So I call this liquid gold because it is so precious. It does so many things for our immune system, our nervous system, digestive system, that has been used for thousands of years by the Greeks, the Persians, and my favorite, King Charlemagne. Because this year in homeschooling, we're learning the medieval history, and so we learned about King Charlemagne. And it was really interesting to read that he had Melissa plants in his royal garden. He knew that this is great for our emotions. So the way that I use it is, I'll drop it under my tongue, to calm anxious feelings, and it is a little, bit, a little bit bitter. So if you do that with me, you'll wanna have your water to chase it down. Another great way to increase, increase your immune uh, system, boost it, in, and to help with anxious feelings is to do a little rock and roll of the bottle with your thumb on the opening, just like that. Now the oil is on your thumb, and you can touch the roof of your mouth. It's a great way to calm anxious feelings. You can already start to breathe it in. And again, if it's a little bit bitter for you, drink some water. The other thing Melissa essential oil is good for is our skin. So if you tend to be someone who um, experiences breakouts around the mouth when your immune system is challenged, Melissa essential oil is great to put around your mouth. It's also great as a beautification oil. Just a drop in your moisturizer helps to improve the appearance of your skin. Moving on to the citrus essential oils, these are some of my favorites because they're very uplifting. They're great to diffuse and to help to calm any anxious feelings. They are uplifting and happy, and um, they're also cleansing for the body. So the way to use them as cleansers for the body is just to drop them in your water. You've got your water, right? So just put a drop in there and take a sip. And I like to use um, jars like spaghetti um, sauce jars that I upcycle into drinking jars. And you know how sometimes there's that um, label that sticks there, the sticky residue? Well, guess what? That sticky residue comes off with just a drop of lemon oil. You just put it on the sticky residue, rub a little bit, and it comes off like magic. And so that's what it does inside your body too. When you drink the lemon essential oil, it helps to break up any sticky residue inside your gut system. Now, um, the other thing that lemon essential oils are great for 
is um, for detoxification of other areas like our home. So if you want to know how to make some really affordable and easy cleaners, go to the Reducing Toxic Load videos. Those are amazing. I wash all my fresh produce like my apples and the lettuce that we eat in water with a couple drops of lemon essential oil or green mandarin essential oil, any citrus essential oil. And I soak my produce in that, take it out, dry it, and then we can eat it raw without worry. I love that. So, um, drinking essential oil, uh, citrus essential oils, not only help us detox, it helps us to be in an antioxidant state. When our bodies are in an antioxidant state, our immunity is stronger too, and that's good to know for this time. All right, next, copaiba essential oil is amazing. It's a very gentle essential oil. You can be used on the skin without um, really any worry. Um, and then it also has... Um, beta carophylline, which is really effective in the endocannabinoid system. The endocannabinoid system is throughout your entire body, but mostly in your immune system. So when you use copaiba, it's like using a key to turn on your immune system. It really boosts your immune system up. Moving on to breathe essential oil. Oh, the other thing is you can ingest this too. It's really good ingested for the immune system. So again, same way. Under the tongue, just like that a little bit out okay drink some water all right turning on the immune system next we have um, breathe essential oil this is amazing amazing because it helps to um, open up the airways it has one eight cineole and the eucalyptus oil really interesting so you put a drop here and you just rub your hands together and you can make your own little human diffuser with your hands where you just make a O cup here and you just breathe in and you can really feel it opening up your airways and then you can rub the rest over your chest love breathe okay now it's really synergistic if you are able to diffuse the two of these breathe and copaiba oil then let's move on to um, stronger and calmer these are kid essential oil blends, but they can be used for adults and for elderly. They're truly amazing. This is stronger. So it's, I like to call it the kid version of On Guard, except it has different oils. It has four oils. The first is Listea. The second is um, frankincense. The third is cedarwood. And the fourth is rose. So it has frankincense, which is the king of all oils, and rose, which is the queen of all oils. And so this is like a royal oil. Okay, so the way to use this is I have my kids roll it on their feet and then put on some socks. I roll it on their neck, okay? I roll it on their wrists and I tell them, take a smell. That's what we do every night before bed, okay? Um, Next, the Calmer Essential Oil is another one that you, we use at bedtime because this has four very com comforting and soothing essential oils in there. Um, it has Kanaga and it has um, Lavender along with um, Buddha Wood. And the last essential oil in here is going to be uh, Roman Chamomile. So this is a great one to use for nightmares night terrors. Um, I use this for my kids when they have tantrums. Um, I also use this for them when they just need to calm down. So I use this on all of them before we took this video. And they're all coming now because they know that I'm yeah. done with the video. Say hi! hi. hi. <laughs> this is just four of the seven. Oh, here comes one more. I only have one girl. Hi. <laughs> so thank you for listening. Um, I hope that you learned something today about informed self-care. I hope that you can share some of your oils with especially those people that are on the front lines, okay? Um, and to with your neighbors too, after learning about the amazing immune and emotional benefits that they offer. And um, I hope that you catch some of the videos on the other um, uh, Stronger Season series. They're really amazing. So I like the one that has a little workout, the eating right, the... Um, the, 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 the decrease, decreasing toxic load, the sleep exercise one is great. So um, lots here for you to learn. Thank you.